Hi everyone, I'm John McBride, and we're here at the King's Playhouse today talking about how to transform your tables for the holiday. Um, the theme of this table is for the birds, uh, and if you haven't figured out why yet, it's quite obvious. This is a nature-inspired uh, tabletop. started with these gorgeous, gorgeous plates, or plates. Um, uh, if you have a special plate or a gorgeous plate, this is a great opportunity to make it the focal point of your plate settings. Uh, I pair them with plain plates here, just so that there's not too much competition for them. Right? Uh, you don't have to use everything in a particular set of, of dishes. You can just choose to select one specific plate and then frame it with other plates or chargers around it. Uh, uh, to carry on that bird theme, we've done the napkins um, that, that also um, have similar birds on them, and we've done these beautiful feather top trees. Um, I've had these for like almost three decades. Uh, I think I bought them in the 90s. Uh, they uh, are wonderful because they stack inside of each other, so they're great for storing off season. And of course, we've added some pine cones, and we've added a couple of like little teal ornaments just to bring in that color that's coming in from the plates. This place setting is the only table we've done uh, in this series that is a formal place setting. Um, it means that uh, we put out all the cutlery that will be used for the meal and all of the glassware and the stemware. Uh, so we've got our bread and butter plate, we've got our meal, and then we've got our, our uh, stemware and our water glass. Uh, if you have trouble remembering how to set this up, I'm going to give you a really easy tip. We all would love to drive a beautiful BMW, correct? So, B for bread, M for meal, W for water. So if you always remember that, you'll always get the order correct. It also helps when you have a really big table and people are close together, you're trying to figure out which is your glass and which is your butter plate. BMW will always do it for you. When you're eating, you always start from the outside and you work your way in. So for this course, we're starting with soup. We're then moving to a salad or a second, an appetizer that requires a knife and a fork and then we're moving to a main that requires a knife and a fork. So you just work your way out. The cutlery at the top is for dessert. Uh, Glassware-wise, we've got a champagne flute, we have a red wine glass, a white wine glass, and a water goblet. The way you can always tell them apart, the red wine glass will always have a larger mouth. It allows the, the red wine to breathe, and the water goblet, if it's not a tumbler, it will have a very, very short stem. So you'll always know which glass it is that you're supposed to be using. Uh, lastly, we've used a, a, a simple plain linen on here, uh, and we've used simple plain flatware because we wanted the plates to be the star of the show. So this is for the birds. I'm John McBride, and we're at the King's Playhouse.